All right, in this video, I just wanna show you the power of keywords. So Andrew's keyword is his long tail keyword, what we call, um, it's a keyword of what people are specifically looking for. It's not just one word, but a keyword phrase. His keyword phrase is custom song reggae style. He wants anybody who's looking to get a custom song reggae style to find him. So let's go ahead and type that in Google, custom song reggae style and press enter and voila, look at this. Okay, there's about 4,460,000 results in Google. Number one is Andrew and this goes directly to his Fiverr gig. Let's click on that and I'll prove it to you. It goes right to his Fiverr gig. What is the title? Custom song reggae style, right? Look at one other thing here with his keyword. So we always tell you to put your keyword in the title of your Fiverr gig. And do you see how it's bolded right here? Google is seeing a direct match in the title of this gig as in right here. So the, as in the Google search that I just did. So custom song reggae, reggae style right there. So the next one is... Uh, my custom song reggae style. And this was the post that we made on the Fiverr forum. Look at that right there. It says right here, um, his title of this forum post is my custom song reggae style gig. And then he puts a link in here to, it's a, a different custom song reggae style gig on Fiverr, but he's got it again here, custom song and reggae style. So the keywords are really, really important. He's being found in Google for the keyword that he wants to be found for, custom song reggae style. Now, if somebody is looking to get a custom song created reggae style, are they gonna pick Andrew? He's number one, he's number two. Let's skip those two. He's also number three. Let me show you how he got this number three. This number three was by one of his orders, somebody who ordered him, pinned it on Pinterest. So he asked people, if you like it, please share it. Somebody shared it by pinning it on Pinterest. And when you pin it on Pinterest, it takes your title and puts it in the pin that they have here. Andrew Reed Live, sing a custom song reggae style for any occasional, any occasion, $5 on Fiverr. So those sharing buttons are important. What Andrew needs to do, let's go back to his gig right here. If he'd like to keep getting, you know, top rankings for this keyword is ask other people to pin it, to put it on LinkedIn, to tweet it, to put it on Facebook. So you see these so social sharing buttons here. These are really good for um, getting you rankings for this gig. And so he also has his keyword custom song in his description. It's in his title. The video is saved with the keyword custom song. The picture he has is saved with the keyword custom song. So he's custom song reggae style. So he's really ranking well for that keyword. Just a quick example. What you want to do is go to Google, type in your keyword, see where you rank. If you're not ranking high like he is, fix it. Look at your titles, look at um, how you can post on the Fiverr forum. There's a bunch of different things that you can do and you need to keep going through the backlinking strategies as we are teaching you different backlinking strategies so that you understand how you can really make this work and get on the first page of Google for your keywords. All right, checking out. This is Alicia. Hope you enjoyed this video. Go ahead, Google your keyword and see where you rank.